Welcome to episode 171 of Clarity Compressed. My name is Paul J. Daly. I'll be your host. And today we're going to talk about what makes business more meaningful, really, truly meaningful. We're making our way through the fog of life and Clarity is understanding where we are on the map. You are here. <laughs> Let the good times roll. This is Clarity Compressed. So at my agency, we have a saying. It's actually our vision. It's not only our business vision, but this is something that I, I adopt and I adhere to in my personal life. Um, but as it plays out in business, whether that's company culture, whether that's sales, marketing, branding, community involvement, whatever, it goes like this. Ready? Business is more meaningful when people connect on a human level. Now, there is an art and a science and a whole lot of work that goes into getting a big idea and getting it into a sentence. Most people can write down what they believe in a page of writing, right? You can start to explore it, write it down. Some people can easily write it out in 10 pages of writing. It takes a lot more thoughtfulness and work to get that down into a paragraph and a lot more thoughtfulness and work to get it down into a sentence. And the reason I was able to get mine into a sentence is because I spent a little time with Donald Miller. You may recognize the name, um, New York Times bestselling author, the creator of Business Made Simple. His original product story brand was kind of the his way into the business world, but now he's building an empire. And I went to a workshop in Nashville right before COVID. It was almost the last, it was the last trip I took before COVID and spent a day in a room with him and, and several other people. And the workshop was called Mission Statement Made Simple. And it really was a course in trying to get you to learn how to truncate and distill your message into a, a saying, into a, a word. And I thought I did it well. And I thought, you know, I understand Donald. I understand what I'm doing. I went up and I was like, here's what I have. And he read it and he said, that's totally confusing to me. And I was like, dang it. I thought I nailed it. I thought I was going to impress him. And I didn't. But the flip side of that was me getting to this. Business is more meaningful when people connect on a human level. A lot of times we talk about sales and we talk about likes and followers and social traffic. In the end, the things that make people stay to you is this element of connection on a human level. That's why my agency, we call ourselves a connection agency. We're not a marketing agency, not a brand agency, not a creative agency, not an ideas agency. We're a connection agency because that meaningful connection is what actually brings people closer to you. What brings people closer? You know, one of my other business mentors, Gary Vaynerchuk, has this great story he tells about Ricky Henderson. And if you know, Gary grew up in North Jersey. So, um, you know, Ricky Henderson plays for, played for the, I think it was the Oakland A's, right? Really far from New York. And he was at a baseball game. And, you know, he was messing around with his friends as a kid. And Ricky Henderson used to steal bases a lot. He went to steal second base. And he got tug out and tagged out, tug out. He got out. And he was jogging back to the dugout. And as he was jogging back, he made eye contact with Gary and he winked at him. And from that moment, Gary was a Ricky Henderson fan. And all Gary's friends had to be Ricky Henderson fan. If you know Gary, you're like, oh, okay, now he becomes an ambassador. And so Gary says, he's like, what is the ROI of a wink? Right? What is that ROI of a wink? And what did he do in that situation? But he connected on a human level. So whenever we're building our businesses and we're moving forward in um, you know, building a team or building a product or designing a storefront, or designing a website, or coming up with a piece of marketing, or brand, or something like that, it's easy to get into our own heads and talk about all the things that we love and all the things that we're excited about. But the reality is, until you do the work to understand what is the human level connection that I can make that's going to make that person move forward, move closer to me. And what that really comes down to is, what can I do that is meaningful to them? All advertising is an interruption, all of it, all of it, all of it, all of it, because somebody was on their way to do something. Somebody was on their way to do something. I'm looking at pictures. I'm looking for a clubhouse room. I'm doing all that stuff. And what happens? An ad pops up, interruption. The ad just interrupted me. It stopped me from doing what I was going to do. 
And the difference between seeing that interruption as valuable or annoying is the level of meaningful connection that can establish in that moment. Something gets your attention, you stop. Is it meaningful? Your brain's making this decision in split seconds, right? We divvy out our attention in micro increments. The understanding of what is meaningful to someone and how you can build a meaningful experience is the difference between winning and losing in business and not just in the short term. Because sure, you can create a piece of media that gets somebody's attention and maybe even gets them to buy, right? You got them in the mode and they purchased. But they're not really connected. There's no meaningful connection in those scenarios unless you've done something to really understand what they care about, what they value, what their aspirations are, what their fears are. And when you do the work to understand those, then you can start to understand what might be meaningful to them. Let me give you a hint. Regular life things. Life is lived out in the nuanced, meaningful things, the small things. And when we can bring out the beauty in the meaningful things or connect the dots between the meaningful things and why they matter and why they're important and show people that they also matter to us, you're going to connect. And when you connect, business all of a sudden becomes more meaningful. And not just connect over something cool or something flashy, but connect on a human level. The same things drive every human, or at least most humans, if you're not like a total psychopath. Acceptance, care, concern, the desire to see the results of your work in a tangible way. We all want to see that. We want to feel good about ourselves. We want to feel like people like us, that our contribution is worth it, that if we weren't around, that we would be missed. That's a meaningful way. One of the things in my personal life, one of my goals for my life is for people to be able to say, I'm better off for the time I spent with him. And I don't care if that is one minute on this podcast and we never meet in person or know each other's names, or if that is someone who has worked with me for a decade, or if that is someone like my children who has lived with me for their entire life. Metaphorically, I hope they go home. I mean, I hope they go out on their own at some point. That's the goal. Whether that's my wife, I want everyone to be able to say that my life was better off and more meaningful for the time that I spent with him. Because all this stuff, like my social media audience, you know, the things that you see, like, I know. If I were to get hit by a bus, everybody would say, that's tragic, right? People would post some nice things and then they'd be on with their life. And, you know, obviously my family, they'd be much more affected. But meaningful things. So how do you make business more meaningful? Connect on a human level. So I hope that you look at what you're doing in your business. I hope that you look you look at what you're doing in things like your branding, your marketing, your company culture, how you treat people, how you allow people to interact within your company. All of that matters. If you're allowing a bunch of nonsense to go on in your company, you're allowing venom to be spit and you're allowing people to be taken advantage of or victimized, like you're, you're ruining the, mean, the best things about business. You're letting it happen in front of you. So when you want to make business more meaningful, and I would make that a very close simile to you want to make business more successful, you're going to figure out ways to let people connect and connect with people on a human level. Business is more meaningful when people connect on a human level. Try it. And I think really quickly you'll realize that it's the right way to go. Thanks so much for spending some time. I'm glad that we can connect on a human level. I hope the transparency and the honesty do just that because I'd rather be connected with 100 people on a meaningful human level than 10,000 people on a surface i I'll tap a heart every once in a while when I see your post level. Speaking of connecting, uh, we are having a meetup. I'm hosting a meetup on June 8th in Tampa. It's uh, I'm giving a keynote at Digital Dealer. After that, that evening, hosting a meetup. You can Still get tickets. They're closing this week. We're almost to capacity, but if you're going to be in the area, we'd love to meet you. You get food and drinks and swag and get to hang around a bunch of people. And we got a big banner that you can take a picture in front of. And it's going to be an awesome time. Speaking of connecting on a human level, but until next time, I hope you take care of one another and please try it this week. Try to focus on connecting with people on a human level and you see what happens. Talk to you soon. We came to fight.